Steve Stevenson, we have head coach Dave Trumbo, senior Anika Schwartz, and sophomore Julie Nightline. Coach, uh, just an opening statement on the match tonight. Uh, first, I want to congratulate Johns Hopkins. Uh, they really played well tonight, and they were the better team. Uh, and I'd also like to thank uh, the athletic program at Stevenson University for their support throughout the season and what they've done for this tournament and all the hard work of all the people at Stevenson that have made it possible uh, for us to host and uh, really did a you know, top-notch job that we can all be very proud of. Yeah. Um, obviously, they came out you know, pretty solid and were able to take the first two sets. Um, what was the message to the team after the second set knowing they had to not that you haven't done that this year, obviously you did it against um, Muhlenberg earlier in the season, but um, what was the message to the team after that second set? Well, that, we had one of those seasons where we, it had to be perfect in order for us to host. And so we never got to the point where we have been pushed lately like that. And unity, staying together, composure, being patient and waiting for, you know, not getting too anxious and trying to put the ball through the roof, or excuse me, through the floor, uh, went on a ball that was too low and just, and just trying to play within ourselves. Uh, and we did get a little something going in that third set and we thought we were going to be able to turn things around, but uh, we were out of system a little too often, and, and Hopkins serve. They're the top serving team in the country for a reason. They missed 16 tonight, but they still controlled the game with their serve. And um, so we had to take out of system swings, which put them in system, and they're tough to stop when they're in system. Yeah. Um, Julia, just want to talk about, you know, obviously all season you had great support, what it meant to play, especially these last two matches in front of big crowds and very supportive crowds. Just what it meant to play in front of. Oh, it was. Yeah. We were like honestly kind of surprised when we first saw everyone come out. But then like it's NCAA's. We shouldn't be surprised. And they did an amazing job, especially scaring Hunter half to death, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> but and they did a good job, especially that third third set when we came back. And it meant a lot to have the school behind us. It just sucks. Um, Coach, what was was there any big difference between the match a few weeks ago, which you're fortunate enough to win, and then the match tonight? I was just was it the serving? Was it? I thought I thought well, like Simone Bliss um, did not play well last time. She hit you know below 100 and had 14 errors. And the big difference was you know, tonight she hit 333. She had 17 kills. Uh, and because they had switched to a 5-1, the matchup was a little bit different in the front row than it was the first time around. All the matchups, and you know, we'll, we we want to get Mariah up front. You know, with her blocking on the uh, right side was mean meaningful. But uh, Simone got on tonight, and we got her a couple times, but uh, she never stopped swinging. And uh, last time she didn't pass as well either. And uh, this time she passed better. Yeah. Um, Anika, obviously this is the last match of your career. Obviously, you know. You and the program had a great four years while you've been here. Um, what does it mean? Well, obviously the result wasn't what you wanted to be able to cap your career by being have, having your team have the opportunity to host mm -hmm. and you know to be in the NCAA's to win a first round match and have the opportunity to play in front of your home fans. Mm -hmm. Well, Stevenson Athletics has really done a lot for me. Like I am so grateful to the school and the program. Um, Coach Adams is always behind us and always behind my team, so I'm just really grateful to be able to have played my four years at this school. Um, but it was amazing to be able to host and be at home. My family could come. I have a big old family down there waiting. They're all here, and they're so excited, and we can have that home crowd. All your friends are cheering you on your senior season. It's just like it's kind of the dream. Yeah. But in this case, it's a little bittersweet because then all your fans are there. But I'm just really grateful to be able to have played – so well this year, my senior season, and just have this be like the best season of my four years and the best even season that Stevenson Volleyball has seen. So just all gratefulness on this end. All right. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you.